Hi guys, here we have another unboxing for you today. I have an idea what it is, but we shall soon find out. Yes, the Cubot Quest. Pretty good specification on this phone. It's another one of those um, rugged phones meant to be waterproof and rug indestructible. So let's have a look. Android 9 out of the box, 4 gigabytes of RAM and 64 gigabytes of ROM. We have the phone. Oh, that's nice. Not too thick. Two cameras on the rear, a 12 megapixel, and I think it's a 0.2 megapixel, a fingerprint reader. That's pretty good. What else do we have here? We have the instruction manual. Regulations and all that. You don't really need the instruction manual once you've used one Android phone, they're all the same. UK charging plug, and that's uh, 5 volts, 2 amps. Sim eject needle and Type C USB charging lead, and I believe that's everything in the box. So, there you are an unboxing of the Cubot Quest waterproof 4 gigabytes of RAM, 64 gigabytes of ROM, NFC technology, Android 9 5.5 HD IPS display, Gorilla Glass. 12 megapixel main camera plus 2 megapixel Sony sensor MT6762 2 gigahertz processor optical and a 4000 mAh battery that's a pretty big battery that is for a slim phone I mean that's quite slim not too heavy if it's a nice and light phone Look forward to doing a full review on this one. Thanks guys, I'll see you soon. Hi guys, here we have another unboxing for you today. I have an idea what it is, but we shall soon find out. Yes, the Cubot Quest. Pretty good specification on this phone. It's another one of those um, rugged phones meant to be waterproof and rugged indestructible so let's have a look android 9 out of the box 4 gigabytes of ram and 64 gigabytes of rom we have the phone oh that's nice not too thick Two cameras on the rear, a 12 megapixel, and I think it's a 0.2 megapixel, a fingerprint reader. That's pretty good. What else do we have here? We have the instruction manual. Regulations and all that. You don't really need the instruction manual once you've used one Android phone, they're all the same. UK charging plug, and that's uh, 5 volts, 2 amps. Sim eject needle, and Type C USB charging lead, and I believe that's everything in the box. So, there you are an unboxing of the Cubot Quest.
waterproof, 4 gigabytes of RAM, 64 gigabytes of ROM, NFC technology, Android 9, 5.5 HD IPS display, Gorilla Glass, 12 megapixel main camera plus 2 megapixel Sony sensor, MT6762, 2 gigahertz processor, optical, and a 4000 mAh battery. That's a pretty big battery, that is, for a slim phone. I mean, that's quite slim. Not too heavy, but it's a nice and light phone. Look forward to doing a full review on this one. Thanks, guys. I'll see you soon.